we'd do something slightly different. Normally I video my whole day all about my life and everything, but say I thought we'll just do a vlog dedicated to secondhand shopping. Yay! So I know a lot of my subscribers do love secondhand shops and I just thought we'll just do a proper little video all about secondhand shops. So I'm on route to a little town that's got probably about I don't know 10 charity shops it's got quite a lot of charity shops and they're normally pretty good so I thought we'll go and we'll just dedicate this whole video to secondhand shops so I hope you enjoy it I hope it's going to work out well and I'm also hoping to find um, like a little goodie like a little prize that I can give away at the end of this video so I really hope you're going to enjoy it so off we go shopping and let's see what's in those secondhand shops i just love them i find them so interesting i spend a lot of time in them um and i think sometimes people misjudge them they don't realize how good they are so i thought i'll just go and i'll just show you probably know my look they may not be very good today because that is the thing with secondhand shops sometimes you go and they're really really good and another day you go and they, you just don't find anything that you like but I love the people that volunteer in them they're just there's some really lovely quirky people that help out in them and they're just brilliant I love them I'm sure that one day I should go and work in one because they're just brilliant so off we go my dears I hope you're going to enjoy this little video and let's go shopping It's a car of sea, I don't like having a meander like throwing them down. Thank you. 
you've enjoyed this little second hand shopping trip um, I will show you what I bought when I got home I didn't buy loads but only because I was trying to be good because I do already own an awful lot of clothes and stuff so I only try and buy something if it's something I really really love um, and I may have got a couple of treats for you Woo I'm so excited so I'll show you when I get home but I hope you enjoyed it um, obviously I didn't try any trousers or dresses on because today I was really only focusing on sort of jumpers and tops because that's what I was looking for myself but obviously the second hand shops are full there's children's stuff men's stuff beautiful stuff for your home there's books cds toys obviously loads of children's stuff and they're just lovely so I just wanted to try and show it all as best I could a little you know English town full of second hand shops so I hope it was enjoyable to watch anyway so I'm going to get myself home um, and then we'll have a look what I bought right we've made it home so let me show you what I bought for my little second hand shopping trip so first of all I got my daughter some little vintage My Little Ponies which I know they're vintage because I had some of these when I was little so I think my daughter is going to love these because um, they are old they must probably be from like the 1980s I think they are a little bit grubby so I will have to get a, a damp cloth and clean them up but I love them because they're vintage um, I got a lovely jumper which originally from was from Wallace um, it was £4.75 and it got all different sort of light neutral sort of colours on it so it's got pinks, browns, greys and but I really like it, it was really soft as well then I got um, a Kenzo jumper uh, which is from H&M I know these are very expensive when they're new so I think this was really nice it's black and it's got all little like badges across it that's so lovely so it just shows what you can buy from second hand shop so this cost me £5.75 they were slightly more than you normally pay for a jumper but I think it's because they were quite um, posh makes I think and then I got the Dior saddle bag which is obviously it's not a genuine one um, but I thought you know if you just want to have one just as like a bit of a spare it still is quite a good copy and to say that it's come from a second hand shop it really doesn't matter I think it's okay so that was my little uh, bargains that I got it's in really good condition as well I can't believe that I found a bag it was so funny um, and then I also got some little prizes for you so I have uh, one two three four five prizes but I'm just going to split them into um, I don't know let's split them into so we do two or three the trouble is it's postage I don't mind posting them anywhere in the world but it's the cost of the postage that adds up so we'll do three I think so um, the first prize which I think is the best the first prize so the first name I'll pick out will be for this gorgeous lovely scarf and it's really really soft it, I don't know if it's wool or not but it's really really soft and it looks like lace but it's not lace obviously um, the inside of it's like just plain and then it has got these cute little tassels on the end and I think it's really nice I think it looks lovely and I was so tempted to keep it myself but I thought Jane no you bought these this for your lovely subscriber so please share it <laughs> so I am giving it away it is so nice I really like it so that's the top prize the next prize is let me see let's put this out of the way the next prize is a very cute Mr Happy because I was hoping that this video has made you happy um, he does say squeeze me on the back but unfortunately he doesn't work anymore which is the joys of second hand shops sometimes stuff gets a bit unloved when it stops working but I just thought it was Mr Happy so I'm hoping this video has made you happy and then to go with him we've got obviously not real but a Chanel necklace Ta -da! it's very very shiny all its stones are still intact it's got no stones missing it's quite a big necklace and then it comes on a, a silver coloured chain I think it looks really nice it's ever so pretty in the light so that is the second prize so you win Mr Happy and the Chanel style necklace and then the third prize although they're all really nice is a little compact mirror which is like mirrored effect and then you open it up, and it's mirrored. 
there we go so that's the third prize and then also there's this lovely little necklace let's have a look it's so pretty so it comes in its own little pouch and there we go it's got like a blue stone and some like little I don't know like little feathers or wings that come up from it but I think it's so pretty it shines so much it's so lovely so those are the prizes so all you've got to do is obviously like this video comment down below and just tell me what you liked on my video uh, was there a particular item you spotted on one of the shelves in the second hand shop that you thought was really nice or did you really like one of the jumpers I tried on or did you spot a pair of shoes that were really nice? Just comment down below what you enjoyed, what you really thought that was really nice in this video. So thank you very much for watching. Um, I will let this um, prize run, uh, look, I can't even words I'll let this prize run for a couple of weeks. So today's date is the 26th of October, so we'll pull it as we get into November 2018. Um, and just good luck everybody so thank you very much for watching if you have enjoyed this little shopping vlog please subscribe and come and find me on Instagram and Twitter as Mrs Crazy Bag Lady so I love you and leave you I'll speak to you soon and if you want to win one of the little prizes please comment down below take care my dears hope you enjoyed it bye